Good morning everybody, it's Monday morning and it's a little bit twilighty this morning full dark when I got up Thank you, jet engine was on and as you can see, our holiday's over We're off back to work Excited. I'm not excited per se. Uh, I'm okay about it. I'm just checking. I'm not excited at all. Are you? I was doing I was doing a silly thing yesterday. Mm. I was counting how many weeks it is till Christmas. Well that was a mistake. He's fifteen by the way. I don't know. I skipped Halloween completely. Counted to Christmas, 15 weeks to Christmas. And if our thermometer is to be believed this morning, it's 10 degrees. So, not much difference in temperature all year, apart from the odd days. Anyway, I'll let Michelle concentrate and we'll get off to work and I'll snooze in the corner. Move it on. extra points because I figured out what was wrong with your camera without you actually having to show it to me. I nearly had to show it to you. I had a bit of a problem with my camera then. It was in black and white and I couldn't figure it out. Well, I had to move one of the dials on the top. Well, the problem is I couldn't see it and I couldn't get the lights to come on and I've got the lights on and now I still can't see it. But anyway, I think I'm filming. We'll find out later. I'll fix it in post. Uh, yeah, we've just watched what I believe to be an extremely harrowing film or program, 9-11, Life's at Risk, was it? Life Under Attack. Life Under Attack. Well, that was, it was about, obviously, about the 9-11 uh, attacks uh, 20 years ago now, or 20 years and two days, because it's the 13th when I'm recording this. We recorded it at the weekend, and what it basically was was um, people like myself just walking about with cameras and filming what went on and it showed a lot more than I've seen on the news it was absolutely harrowing um, I didn't know that there was three buildings collapsed because one was on fire and that collapsed as well well not surprised a lot of people killed was it 2973 disastrous but yeah it kind of re it really showed you what's and all if you get a little bit sensitive don't watch it that's all I'd say but it's on ITV uh, reason I said don't watch it you can see the people actually jumping out the building rather than burning to death and then the buildings collapsing and there was film of people what were in the buildings when it collapsed as well no, cat's going mad. Anyway, yeah, so we've just watched that. Very harrowing. What did you think? Yeah. Yeah, nasty, wasn't it? Anyway, 20 past seven. I think I'll go and do a bit of editing. Are you doing your reading? Mm -hmm. I'm going to do a bit, uh, bit of editing and then uh, I'll pick another programme to watch. <laughs> Moving on. Hi, guys, and a good Wednesday afternoon. Stroke evening to you, it's half past five. Uh, I forgot to take you guys to work again this morning. Very bad of me, very lax. So, yeah, we're home. Um, all we did last night was I watched the football and I did some podcasting, so I was kind of tied up all night anyway. So, I didn't do much vlogging last night neither. Now, what we're doing, we've had some pizzas in our fridge for a while. We kept thinking, oh, we'll have them, we'll have them, we'll have them. But it's getting to the point where we really, really need to eat them because they just gonna go bad aren't they so they're in we're having pizza for today for today to tea so I've got a stutter don't I? I've come up with a stutter so we're having pizza for today for tea oh god I've done it again for tea and we're um, gonna watch 
a documentary, aren't we? About Michael Schumacher. If you can find it. Was That's it on? supposed to be really good. Clickbait. Yeah. Okay, stick it into onto our list. Never heard of it actually. So before we look, look at that, we're going to go and look at these programs that we can put in a to watch list. Moving on. And there we go, guys. Pizza is served. Gotta love these Tesco pizzas. Twelve minutes in the oven and tea's ready. Sawed.